Hey, what's up fellow toy adventurers? Today we have an incredibly exciting adventure for you. We're diving into the Superman the Mechanical Monsters 5 Points Deluxe Box Set from Mezco Toys. This set is inspired by the classic 1940s animated short and I can't wait to show you all the amazing details. So stay tuned for the unboxing and review, but first, let's talk about the animated shorts. Lois! This is a job for Superman. For those of you who might not be familiar, The Mechanical Monsters is one of the classic Superman animated shorts produced by Fleischer Studios in the early 1940s. Released on November 28, 1941, this short is the second in a series of 17 Technicolor cartoons featuring the Man of Steel. These cartoons were groundbreaking for their time. Featuring advanced animation techniques and bringing Superman to life on screen for the first time. The Fleischer Superman cartoons are legendary. They were the first animated appearances of Superman and were known for their high quality animation and innovative use of rotoscoping, a technique where animators trace over live action footage to create realistic movements. This method allowed for more fluid and lifelike animation, setting a new standard in the industry. In the Mechanical Monster, Superman battles a mad scientist and his army of robots, showcasing the hero's strength and bravery. The influence of this short can be seen in many later works, including the design of robots in several various animated series and films. The Fleischer Studios work on Superman was so impactful that in 1985 DC honored the studio in their 50th anniversary publication, The 50 Who Made DC Great, for their contributions to the character's legacy. These shorts not only set the standard for superhero animation, but also remain beloved by fans to this day. Their legacy continues to inspire animators and filmmakers, proving that great storytelling and innovative techniques can create timeless classics. If you're enjoying this deep dive into Superman's animated history, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to Weird Fantastic Toy Adventures for more awesome content. Your support helps us bring you more great videos. Now let's get into the unboxing. First, let's take a look at the packaging. Mezco Toys has really outdone themselves with this collector-friendly box. It's designed with us collectors in mind and it looks fantastic. Take a look at the front. You got Superman here. You got a, a picture of, of Superman in action fighting the robot right over here. Superman logo here. Mechanical Monsters 1941 Deluxe Box Set and the Five Points logo down here. Take a look at the back. And you see everything that's included in the set here. A mechanical monster comes with two pairs of interchangeable arms for dynamic posing and interchanging propeller that attaches to the neck and removable flame effects that attach to the eyes. And you can see that in the picture here. Plus we have the rotate inner platform and change Clark Kent quick change phone booth over here. Uh, we have the multi-level diorama shown here. And over here, uh, we show that it's a double-sided set that creates multiple action environments. So we got the Mad Scientist Lab, uh, the caverns underneath, and we got the outside of the Palace of Jewels here. So that is the backside. Uh, looking at the top, uh, we have uh, the Superman logo and a deluxe box set there. And uh, on the bottom, of course, we have the warning and UPC code and all this uh, fine print over here uh, made for children intended for adult collectors only it says and uh, on the side we have Superman fighting that mechanical monster with the flame effect shooting out of his eyes and we see the same thing over here now let's get it out of the box
Inside we have three figures, Superman, Clark Kent, and Lois Lane. We also have the giant fire shooting robot, mechanical monster number five, and a quick change phone booth along with a multi-level triple environment diorama. Let's start with Superman. This figure is a strange visitor from another planet with powers and abilities far beyond those of mortal men. He comes with two pairs of interchangeable arms for dynamic posing and a soft molded cape. The detail on this figure is incredible. Look at his face, S on his chest, raised, is actually molded into the plastic and painted. He has his red boots with the notches in them, and of course the Fleischer belt was yellow with a with it was a, had a yellow belt buckle with a red belt. He's got fist uh, arms on. To begin with. Now let's compare this Superman with the McFarlane Toys Superpowers figure of the Fleischer Superman. Here we have the McFarlane Toys Fleischer Superman. The McFarlane figure has seven points of articulation, including knee joints, whereas the Mesco figure only has five points and no knee articulation. The McFarlane figure also features a cloth cape while the Mesco figure has the soft molded cape. Additionally, the McFarlane version is just a repaint of the original book from the Wave 1 Superman figure. But the Mesco figure has a head sculpt that matches the cartoon to a T. Both figures feature the iconic look of the 1940 Superman, but there are some notable differences in design and articulation. Next we have Clark Kent, Superman's alter ego. Clark comes with a little notepad he can hold in his hand to jot down the details of his next story. And we also have a quick change feature in this phone booth as a really fun addition. And here's Lois Lane, the tenacious investigative reporter at the Daily Planet. She comes with a really small notebook accessory to document her next big scoop. Mezco has captured her strong and assertive personality perfectly. Now let's take a look at Mechanical Monster number 5. This oversized machine of mayhem comes with two pairs of interchangeable arms for dynamic posing. An interchangeable propeller that attaches to the neck a hinged compartment on the back of his body, and removable flame effects that attach to his eyes. This figure is truly a masterpiece. The first thing we want to do is put those little flame effects in his eyes. And we got one, and here's the other one, put it right into place. And now we want to transform him. So first thing we have to do is take his head off, and get that little piece there off, and take his arms off, and put the propeller, uh, put the uh, wing arms on. There's one snapping right in place. Get the other one off, and get the arm right on in there. It just snaps right in, pretty tight too. I'm gonna put. The Color on top of him and snap his head right on top. Move his arms around a little bit so we can make those propellers move, that propeller move. Propeller will spin, there we go. And the mechanical monster is now transformed into flight mode. Mesco was nice enough to include an instruction sheet on how to put everything together.
Once assembled, the retro play set diorama creates the well-guarded House of Jewels storefront on one side and a two-story diorama of the mad scientist's lab on the reverse side. The lab comes complete with a little trap door in the floor that opens and rows of mechanical monsters with the secret volcanic cavern below where the monsters are forged. It also comes with a set of opening doors in the wall. This diorama adds so much depth and playability to this set. The Superman figure comes with two sets of interchangeable arms, but we can put open-handed arms on him instead of the closed fists. Snap in good and tight, feel them when they get in place. And you can have one hand with open hand and one arm have the closed. One neat little accessory with this set is the quick change phone booth. The door opens and it is on a hinge so that it can look like a real phone booth door opening and closing. In the interior, we can see that there's a little telephone in there and there's a foot peg for the figure's foot to fit on. So we'll put Clark Kent in first. Get him down on that foot peg. You can see him in there. And there is a place on the side where you can rotate the figure around. And now we can put Superman on the other side. And there's a foot peg in there as well to hold Superman in his place. Oh. Now, we can close the phone booth up and we can move it around and have Clark Kent on one side and Superman on the other side. Overall, the Superman The Mechanical Monsters 1941 Five Points Deluxe Box Set from Mezco Toys is a must-have for any Superman or vintage toy collector. The attention to detail, the dynamic posing options, and the incredible diorama make this set a standout piece. There are a few things that must be taken into consideration with the set. Once this uh, diorama set is assembled, you can't take it back apart again. Uh, another thing that, uh, that you need to be aware of is each figure has a figure stand and the figure stands are not interchangeable between these figures. Superman has a figure stand and his peg is very close to the edge so for his wide stands. Clark Kent has a figure peg, uh, peg that's more in the middle because his feet are more closer together. And finally, you can't put Lois Lane on the men's figure stands because she has a figure stand with a very small peg on it 
for the very small holes that are in her feet. The two accessories, the notepad for Clark Kent and the little steno pad for Lois Lane are very, very small. Very easily lost. So be careful with those as well. And the mechanical monster has all of his interchangeable pieces and he's got the flame effects in his eyes. So be careful and don't lose those when you're taking it out of the package. And finally, I know a lot of people will want to know how does the McFarlane Flasher Superman work with that phone boo? Well, he's a little bit taller than three and three quarter inch, so he's just a little bit too big to fit in that side that phone boo. Too bad. Overall, the Superman the Mechanical Monsters 5 Points Deluxe box set from Mesco Toys is a must-have for any Superman or vintage toy collector. Attention to detail, dynamic posing options, and an incredible diorama make this set a standout piece. Click right here to subscribe to the channel, or click over here for another great toy adventure. Thanks for joining me on today's adventure, and remember, keep on collecting and stay fantastic.